What's going on, UW Gear fans? A little update for you on what's going on. Um, just so everybody knows, we do have some new things that we are working on for this year. Um, I know we haven't done a whole lot <clears throat> new per se uh, in the last year or so, but I've still been trying to get caught up on, on orders that you guys are sending in. Um, what we're working on right now is a couple of things. Uh, one of the first things is we almost have ready to go and not yet. Don't bombard us with emails and, and everything just yet. Um, we will announce it when it's ready, okay? Re rest assured, we'll have a video on here. We'll put it up on Facebook. Um, we'll probably have them on the website. Um, we'll have them on the forum, et cetera, et cetera. We are working on a new pouch that we're bringing out that is going to be a combo pouch. <clears throat> It'll serve two different purposes depending on what you want to do with it. It's going to be a first aid slash bleeder pouch, which will be just for holding your immediate uh, first aid items, such as um, Israeli bandage, um, roll of Curlex, uh, EMT shears, maybe a little uh, petroleum gauze, um, <clears throat> small roll of Coflex, something like that, and your tourniquet. Just as, your again, your immediate bleeder kit, okay? It's not a big full first aid kit. It's just a bleeder kit. That same pouch, uh, in turn, can also be used as just kind of a small GP pouch that you want to put uh, things in. Coincidentally, or maybe not, it's sized and designed to fit perfectly on our Minuteman and Swamp Fox chest rigs. So it's going to be a perfect fit on those for you. It'll match and complement with them as far as not being big and bulky but still giving you what you need. Um, <clears throat> cool thing is the lids on both of them will be using our tuck tab. So you will continue the same tuck tab system with your bleeder and GP pouch as what's on our mag pouches. We won't have to worry about Velcro, we won't have to worry about buckles, we won't have to worry about snaps, none of that. It'll have our silent, uh, dependable uh, tuck tab closure system on it. Um, another thing we're working on along those same lines are some larger GP pouches that will be uh, really ideal on a belt kit for those of you that are wanting to set up a belt kit. Um, they'll be big enough <clears throat> to hold and completely enclose using a fully enclosed lid with our tuck tab system. It'll completely hold a GI canteen, canteen cup, stove, um, etc. It'll hold all of that with the lid completely closed and so no more exposed canteen top and crud getting down into your cup and everything inside and all that. If you don't want to use it for that, again, that'll be about the size of it so you can put all kind of other stuff in there. Um, a couple of those on the back of a belt kit will be a perfect replacement for, you know, like a large uh, butt pack or something. You can get rid of that, put these on there, and there you go. Along with that same notion, we are working on some double mag pouches um, specifically for belt kit. So in concept, you could use our double rifle mag pouches and our uh, small and large GP pouches and completely set you up uh, a belt kit set up if, if that's the way you wanted to run. We do have a couple other little things we're working on and I'm not going to tell you about them. You're just going to have to wait and stay tuned on those. Those are, uh, I think, going to be pretty popular. Um, you'll just have to wait and see. We'll, we'll announce all that when we, when we get it ready to. So again, a lot of stuff we're working on. Still getting orders caught up. Getting the new stuff dialed in. Being so behind on the orders, it takes a little bit longer to get the new stuff done because we just don't have as much time to make up the prototypes, try them out, get out in the field with them, 
test them, make changes where necessary, et cetera, et cetera. It's just all time consuming. So we are working on all that, and I'm hoping this year we can again continue to to make progress like we like we have been. So anyway, there's your little quick update. Um, stay tuned for for what all's coming, and uh, again we. Appreciate everybody's business. Um, take care. Keep your powder dry. We'll see you next time.